about those fireworks got me buzzing and I, I feel like learning something new. So I'm um, going for the impossible. Hey guys, I do realize that I'm not consistent with my tricks and I think the best way to tackle this problem is to learn a new trick. All joking aside, I do practice the basics. I just don't show you guys. Um, I'm working on something new and it's basically a line of four tricks and it's a different set of four tricks each day. If I fail, let's say trick number three in the line, I start all over again. I'm hoping that this will improve my consistency and just make me a better skater. The last set did not go too well. I'll let Yesternan explain what happened. So why has my body decided to grow a second kneecap? While I was doing the front side with 80s, I took a massive whack on the shin and now I am disfigured. Thank you, Yesternan. All right, let's get the ball rolling. So the impossible, in my opinion, is actually one of the best looking tricks in skateboarding, providing that you do it right and not do a free shove. Foot placement appears to be like so. Back foot on the pocket, um, kind of flat, and the front foot doesn't really matter, I think. When you're scooping, you scoop forward, I mean inside, not to the side, which ends up becoming a free shove. Something like that. Uh, security guards are coming. Please don't kick me out. I'm scared. Yeah, it's going to be a difficult trick, but it's super fun to try. <laughs> Trying to land it just with my back foot. Uh, so stepping out It's impossible. Do you know Marbella Skate Park? I made a new friend. <laughs> yeah, so that's the end of today's session. I should be back on it again tomorrow. We're going to do no comply impossible. I'm sorry about this, it's a bit windy. Uh, I've got a new mic as well, the Rode Video Mic. I think that's what it's called. If the audio on this is not great, I'll move back to my wireless uh, recording options. Just check the time and I've got about 10 minutes.
I am really close to the trick uh, so I, I'm sure I can get it in the next two weeks now I need to go meet a friend I made another one <laughs> to you guys what type of videos do you guys prefer do you prefer the vlog style or should I continue what I'm doing right now which is like a movie format well not this video this video is more like a vlog style but I, I like to include movie references in my videos uh, reenact scenes from my favorite movies uh, they're much more fun to edit Vlogs can get very boring to edit for me. I love watching vlogs, other people's vlogs, but I don't like editing and watching my own vlogs. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, I'd appreciate it. <laughs>